645, new on daybreak, supply chain issues are taking a toll on animal shelters as well. The Southside Animal Shelter isn't able to find enough food to feed all the cats and kittens coming in. News 8's Lakin McGee is live outside that shelter. Uh, Lakin, what can people do? Yeah, so next time you go to the grocery store, check the pet aisle. If you see any canned pet food, the Southside Animal Shelter is asking you to make that purchase and help them out. Right now, they have about 125 cats and kittens in the shelter right here behind me and 190 in foster homes. And staff here are also telling me that they are literally getting kittens by the bucket full. So now they're asking for you to help out any way that you can. Here and they're finding, you know, cats, kittens outside or their own pets are, you know, giving birth as well. And so they're showing up literally with buckets of kittens, you know, looking for somewhere for those to go. The Southside Animal Shelter uses 150 to 200 cans of cat food per day. This stash will be gone by the end of the week. Um, the issues that we're having is we are not able to buy the quantities that you need for 200 cats and kittens. She says stores are limiting the amount of canned pet food to be purchased. Their top three items needed daily, canned food, paper towels, and detergent. We do approximately 15 loads of laundry every day here on site, um, as well as the laundry that we have coming back in from our foster homes. So we're struggling to meet the need there as well. With the supply just not there and the limiting of how many items you can buy, Julie says it only takes a few folks donating to help. The Southside Animal Shelter has an Amazon wish list and more items that they do need on their website and on their Facebook page. Now let's go ahead and talk about that 150 to 200 cans that they do per day. If you do the math, that comes out to about over 1,000 cans of pet food a week. That is a lot. Reporting live in Indianapolis, I'm Lakin McGee for Wish TV, wishtv.com, and follow us on Facebook.